our upcoming exhibit, Dinosaurs, Fossils Exposed. And it's really exciting because this is the first uh, dinosaur-related exhibit that we've ever had in our 50 years at the Littleton Museum. We mostly focus on human history, and that's exciting too, but it's always really fun to know and learn about what's underneath our feet as we're walking through our daily lives. What could have lived here millions of years ago? Um, so this is very exciting. These are plaster or plastic, and they've got some resin, and um, they're molded. And the nice thing about that is you can get up so close to it as opposed to uh, you know further away behind glass. It's really cool to be able to see uh, dinosaur bones like this that are so large because when we watch them on TV or see renderings of dinosaurs, it's really cool, but you really don't have that idea of scale with a human being standing beside it. So I'm five foot two, I'm wearing boots, and this bottom part of the leg of the Camarasaurus is almost as tall as I am. It's really kind of cool to be able to see something that you know would just be gigantic. So especially seeing the bone go way, way up nearly to the ceiling. So one thing that's really cool about this area with this exhibit is that with the footprints, um, you can walk right up or come right up to it and compare your hand size to these dinosaur sizes. So the footprint of say an Allosaurus, which is a big carnivore, to maybe a smaller uh, type of carnivore, they're tiny, but they're still really, really impactful. So something that's this small or much, much bigger has survived millions of years. There's a lot of fossils that probably haven't been found yet, but we do know that in Littleton and around Littleton, just south of our borders here, a T-Rex skeleton was found, which is really, really exciting. Now, this is not um, an actual size T-Rex. It's about one third the size of an adult T-Rex, so you can imagine something much bigger and taller. Um, but this is really a cool way for um, our audiences to see something that lived in this area and tromped on this ground many, many millions of years ago. Whether you live in Littleton or you're visiting Littleton, the exhibits that we have here at the Littleton Museum are always thoughtful and provoking as far as an educational content goes. We want our visitors to come away having learned something new. I hope visitors that come to this exhibit come away knowing that here in Littleton, like anywhere else, there's something else beneath the ground. And who knows, maybe someday we'll find something like an even bigger dinosaur than say this Triceratops right next door to the Littleton Museum. You never know what you're gonna find. Mm -hmm.